there are people who have <clears throat> given probably more, more of their financial resources to the university. And there may be somebody who's given more time um, and there may be somebody who's given uh, more in, in terms of uh, their expertise to different things. But I submit to you that there's nobody who has done all three more than Tom Cabin says. He has given so much of himself uh, unselfishly to, to NC State and be it the Wolfpack Club, be it the Alumni Association, um, be it the Caldwell Fellows Program, the Park Scholars Program, the College of Engineering. Tom has never asked for anything in return and, you can, and continues to give and to give and to give. And there's nobody who deserves this Watauga Medal more than Tom Cavanis. Well, Tom was, as far as the Alumni Association goes, we, we, we dragged Tom onto the board when I was the executive director of the Alumni Association here at NC State, and then we started pushing him up the leadership rung, and Tom was a key, key player in bringing the Park Alumni Center online and made that, helped make that a reality. Tom uh, has some particular skills, um, and as, an, as you would imagine, uh, any lawyer, would, most lawyers would have, not any lawyer, but most lawyers would have. Um, he is a very skilled negotiator and he's extremely smart. And so there were a lot of things that had to be negotiated and Tom was the designated negotiator uh, as those situation, situations arose. This building is a, is a remarkable thing to have accomplished and it really involved hundreds if not thousands of people and I was glad to be able to to be a small small part of that but uh, but there are a lot of folks who gave a lot of time and energy to cause this to happen and uh, there are lots of stories along the way that I could tell you. Tom Cabanis's wonderful 125th anniversary celebration challenge gift has had two important impacts on NC State over the previous year. One, it allowed us to add 3,000 new alumni donors to the annual giving program, increasing our alumni giving rate to 13.5%, one of the highest among our peer institutions. Second, his gift was used to match a contribution from the Keenan Charitable Trust. The purpose of that gift was to retain some of our best faculty in the STEM disciplines. Tom is a great guy, is a wonderful friend, has done a lot for the university, and is particularly skilled at a lot of different things. But if I, had, if, if I were going to say to Tom Cabinets, there's one thing you really need to work on, and that's keeping time with the pep band when you stand up to clap. But you want to, you want to learn how to clap with the pep band. You know, Norman Mailer once said that we love those who can lead us to a place we will never reach without them. And I think that describes Tom Cabanis to a T.